Because of COVID-19, 87% of Minnesota students are learning online these days. And that makes science labs or experiments extra tricky. Susan Elizabeth Littlefield shows us how one of Minnesota's largest companies is making sure some students can still be hands-on. Like many kids these days, Maya Consti isn't where she'd like to be. I'd rather be in school. Due to COVID, the Oakdale third grader is doing full-time distance learning and feels like she's totally missing out. It's different because I don't really get to hang out with friends that often. She says she misses her teachers too and hands-on learning. That's where a 3M engineer is stepping in. Maybe there's a science experiment in the air. Kelsey's interest in STEAM started long ago. My grandpa was a science teacher and I always loved conversations with him, learning about science. That's what always kind of drove me. So now her team's making sure students can now do science experiments from home. It's part of a 3M program giving experiment kits to a thousand third graders. To show them that, okay, you're not in school, you're learning from home, but you can still do some of these fun activities and you can still experiment at home. With the help of her own kits, she helped come up with experiments on a pertinent subject, air quality. My kids have, they'll say, mom, what, what does airborne mean? And so it's great to be able to teach them something that's also very relevant right now and using a lot of those same terminologies. It's a concept Maya, who got a kit, now understands. It was surprising to see how dirty the air was. I found a lot of dust in like my dog's hair. And she now understands how her home air filtration works. This is the dirty one. And then this is our clean one. Like most students, she's making things work until COVID leaves the air for good. I'm looking forward to see all my friends without wearing a mask. Susan Elizabeth Littlefield, WCCO 4 News. The 3M Filtrate brand has a list of clear the air kids activities that anyone can do. And we have a link at WCCO.com.